Because the dude went up to me, kicked the ball, and he hit my finger, and it bent it all the way back. It hurt really bad. Well, folks, it was it was really close. Um, 
he was over there. He went down there. We grunted, got him back up here, and I think we were pretty darn sure he went down right over there. We made a good shot. I mean, he was bleeding when he left, so we're going to go down and try and find some blood now. Father, we thank you for this wonderful day, to, for me to harvest this wonderful buck, and for me to spend this wonderful, awesome experience with my first buck with my dad. Thank you, Lord, watch over us. Um, thank you for creating the world and all these animals that we can enjoy um, harvesting. Dear Heavenly Father, amen. Amen. Good job, nice. buddy. Nice. Congratulations. He just got out of velvet too. Look, there's still some velvet right there. Well, that's no, that's bark that he was over there oh. scratching up. Well, he just got out of velvet. Cause see how dark his horns are. Well, it's been it's been a few months. Man, he's got some long brown tines. Yeah. This has got to be one of Snagglehorn's babies. It might be. I, it, cause look at this. He's got a broken one right here. He's got one coming off. So he's a one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's a nine counting this one. Uh, well, folks, um, it was the opening day of rifle season in Missouri, and me and my dad, and it was pretty warm this morning, and we just, and um, I wanted to bring my bow, but we just decided to stick with the rifle today. And I tell you what, they don't go very far with that 357. This, this, uh, nine pointer counting this one. Eight, okay. Um, eight pointer came up on us, snuck right up on us, right in front of us. He w walked off making rubs. My dad snorted him in, and he came right up, made a perfect shot, and he only went about mm, 65 yards from the stand and piled up right here. Beautiful buck, my first ever buck, counting my button buck, but he didn't count. But yeah, it's it's thrilling. I love it. I love deer hunting. You can tell he's in the rut because he's, he's puffed up. Yeah. His hair's all tough. When it does, is nice and soft. Back straps. So, um, hope you, hope your dad takes you out one of these days so you can get one of these. Hopefully they're bigger. <laughs> so, thanks for watching this exciting and thrilling episode of Deer Hunting on in Missouri, open a day of rifle season, so get outside. Catch you.